he's just bringing in each girl, isn't he? Is this like? <laughs> Is this weird? Is this is this harem uh, harem uh, quarterly review time? <laughs> oh God! Hello, everybody. Welcome back to another anime reaction here on the Genreverse YouTube channel. It is ADR squared, and we are here with our uh, classroom of the elite season three, episode thirteen. Is it twelve or 13? thirteen? Thirteen. 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 Episode thirteen uh, reaction. I am Kyle, joined by my wife. Christine, our husband, O'Brien, and you guys should totally be subscribed to the Genreverse YouTube channel because there's a lot of great content on here. Anime reactions, uh, trailer reactions, podcasts covering anything and everything in geek, pop culture, entertainment, um, live streams. We just did a uh, live um, review for season one of Free Run. Uh, I put timestamps in there so you can go check it out. And um, yeah, gaming streams, more uh, lrmonline.com for all of our content, including uh, the old-fashioned, written, or typed entertainment uh, news, articles, uh, reviews, celebrity interviews from LRM YouTube channel, and more. And, of course, we do have merch. Link for that in the description box below. Brian's channel, Pulp Mythos, also linked in the description box um, below. So, last week was an interesting week. Um, I had said while we were watching, I was like, we're going to get some hate for this. And sure enough, we, uh, we did, which is fine. Um, but I do want to say, I do want to say something. Um, we weren't being pervy for pervy's sake. And, and for those of you that might not know, yeah, we, we absolutely can be dirty minded. We're not ruined. We're not ruined by anime. We're not ruined by, by pornography or anything like, uh, like that. I mean, Christine and I watch Konosuba. There's other shows on there that, that are dirty, um, as, as well. So yeah. We don't mind the occasional dirty joke, but um, last week's moments were weird to us. As as three individual siblings, I have a younger sister. She has a younger brother. Brian has a younger sister. A lot of what happened on screen was not quite what we would um, do with our, our siblings. Christine, would you like your brother to hold your face, caress your hair? I would be so creeped out by that. Like, it's just <laughs> not there. And I never saw, like, any of my friends with their siblings like yeah. that either. But yeah. And like, that's no. not a that's not a judgment on any cultures where maybe people are closer. I know that physical contact between siblings in America ends a lot earlier than you might see in, say, Europe. Uh, we don't hold hands with our siblings much after like, I don't know, four, five, maybe six, <laughs> you know, the, the days of kissing your sibling on the cheek or the forehead are done pretty freaking, um, pretty freaking early. And I understand others, other, uh, cultures might be closer, even friends, male friends, female friends, hold hands and stuff in public way longer in Europe than they do here in the, in the U S um, generally speaking. So in the grand context of things, yeah, the, that scene was really, really weird uh to us um but we understand that for the most part it wasn't meant to be it's not meant to be a uh a uh, sexy type thing and or sexual type thing it's meant to be meant to be more you know emotional but it came off weird and um yeah if you yeah. if you had told me like they were siblings after seeing that i would have been surprised like just seeing something like that where it's like it, they look like a couple yeah. so just as it was on screen all right yeah. so that being said again we're not judging anyone who is closer any type of of more physical we get it it's it's different you know um thinking something is weird is not innate to like hating or making fun of or or judging and at, but even at the same time if you took it that way you know oh well my culture is like this it's weird that yours isn't in that the what you're kind of uh, not you specifically, but in that what kind of like some people are, you know, might be accusing us of. So just keep that in context. There was a lot of stuff going on um, and it's still weird. I would never, ever, ever hold my sister's face or caress her hair like that. Like uh, we I love my sister. I give her a hug. I, I've, I've consoled my crying sister before, um, but that was that was different. So anyways, now that we've lost everyone else. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get into uh, this final episode of uh, Season 3, Classroom of the Elite. <laughs> Brian, what are they Dude, doing? What is... 
<laughs> what did I say? Right before we we were recording, we were waiting on on Christine to to get done, and I was like, he was like, "What what is this episode going to be like?" And you literally were like, "They were getting coffee." <laughs> okay, because I was like, "What did I miss? <laughs> I don't get the." Yeah, joke. I was like, "It's either going to be like flashbacks or just them oh. having coffee." <laughs> First, I was like, "What could it be?" Frames. <laughs> Yeah, it's been a while talking about the library and stuff. Almost forgot about her. <laughs> yeah, he did. <laughs> mm-hmm. Weren't we suspicious of her the first time we met her in the library? I think so. And now she knows about that. Talking about putting puzzle pieces together. It can be. Man. He's just bringing in each girl, isn't he? Is this like, is this That's weird? Is this is this harem uh, harem uh, quarterly review time? <laughs> oh God! You know, it's the it's the end of the year re, it's the end of the year evaluations for the harem girls. That's <laughs> all over coffee. Oh. So weird. <laughs> I swear to God, if Ichinose or Susan A comes in for a cup of coffee, Dude, next, if that's the whole episode, I, would... <laughs> and I want these girls to walk past each other one by <laughs> one. I need this in my life. <laughs> oh, to be a fly on the wall. <laughs> I swear I didn't read anything, I didn't look anything up. being evaluated be quiet (laughs) she'd rather sit here you say you guys were making out versus have things in common and talk (laughs) Uh uh-huh liar (laughs) You failed your evaluation. I, I know. Look, man, this is not the guy that you want to walk up to and be like, I can use you. You need to, like, you need, you need to appeal to him on how he can use you. <laughs> yeah. Like, oh, wait, wait. Senku, where he's like, mm. you, you try to convince people it was their idea. Yeah, yeah. So. Yeah. With the help of Gen. He needs again. Yeah. <laughs> And can't you guys just focus on the end of the year? <laughs> he said he would give you his best, yeah. not that he is. There you go. <laughs> Ooh, <laughs> spicy. <laughs> I enjoy the fight. Why are you in the rain, girl? 
It's so dramatic. Oh, I know why she was there. She's wearing that white shirt, that white blouse or whatever. That was on purpose. She needs to <laughs> dry she, off. She's she's uh she, she's actively participating in her year end review here, her <laughs> year end evaluation. She's making sure certain things are on display. See now we're being dirty for dirty's sake. Mm-hmm. To a degree, and you can trust him a lot until he needs to trick you or lie to you to get what he wants. Get stronger. Set yourself up with a good team. For your next year end vow. That's dramatic. You know, there's one lesson in this show um, that I think I I don't know if we've ever talked about this, um, and I'm I'm hoping this you know school is trying to teach them this. Um, no spoilers, guys, but uh, the idea of healthy competition, the idea mm -hmm. of being able to go balls to the wall uh, against somebody in good with good form in good faith. And no matter who comes out on top, being able to accept that and and move forward. I I mention a lot in in reviews and reactions uh, my my military service and how I've always enjoyed you know when I when I made it into leadership roles of bringing subordinates not just up to my level but you know setting them up on a path to one day be higher ranking than me, especially after I retired and whatnot. Um, and uh, in the military, it uh, the the pyramid for ranks gets very very skinny depending on the job for you know your last your last few ranks and it's very very competitive and you're competing against your peers for uh, school slots and military uh, uh, like badges and special skills and things that you can put on your your record or like your resume um, when you're applying you know going for the next promotion next job um, all of that matters but it's it's healthy. And while, yeah, man, you're driven, you know, Sergeant Smith, man, I gotta, I gotta beat him. I gotta beat his ass on this PT test. And you, you're going head to head. It's just like a good fight, you know, like a UFC fight or a boxing fight, man. Those two are, they're throwing it all at each other in the ring. But, you know, before that first bell and after that, that last bell, it's, there's respect, there's mm -hmm. understanding. And, uh, I hope the kids are going to uh, hope the kids are going to learn that. And I hope that's part of what the school might be teaching. <laughs> uh, wait, what? Sorry, that was really fast. Couldn't really yeah. re read it because he seems really upset. <laughs> I could have more easily and safely won five matches in a special exam. For the rest, please talk to. Oh my God! <laughs> oh, he didn't really lose, though. Do you bring him in? Do you tell him? Ah, uh, he might already know. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what was the point of that? You, you know he's going to kick your ass. I think he's just testing the waters, that's all. Mm -hmm. 
<laughs> Grow up with a purpose, damn it. <laughs> I guess I'll listen to you. I mean... What? 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 I know what he means. I know what he's. I know what he's getting at, guys. I know. I know what he's getting at. There, there needs to be a little work here with some of these translations. I like the best there. I, I wouldn't mind the challenge from you or something like that, but I wouldn't mind being crushed by you. Oh God. <laughs> she didn't do so hot on her evaluation, man. You guys should buy her a scone. Scones go with coffee, right? <laughs> oh yeah she does something bad <laughs> he was running Get bent. Throat punch him. There's no cameras. Or he's got him turned off, you know? Oh. 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 Gauntlet thrown down. Gloves off. Uh oh. So when he said you got to figure out who this student is by April one, that means next year. So is that our our mission for the next school year? You know, the like um, the next season is gonna be I on a Koji trying to figure out who is the 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 other white room kid. <gasps> yeah, sure, whatever. That's the best lie you could come up with. <laughs> And are you always spying on Ayana Koji? <laughs> yeah. yeah, I know, right? <clears throat> oh, girl, if you only knew how much his contribution has really been. <laughs> Uh huh. Sure. I think he means point seven or point eight percent. None of your business. I know, right? <laughs> it isn't. Ah. Gets to keep the promise to the brother. <laughs> Sounds like next year is going to be fun. Looking forward to it. Damn. Yeah. Well, 
I don't want to talk too much yet. Let's finish up what's here after the credits, and then we'll talk more about the uh, episode and season. <clears throat> <sighs> it's just because it's him. <laughs> what plans? I think you're about to be asked out. Everyone thinks we're dating. Why don't we actually try it? He knows. Aww. <laughs> ding 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 wow you wanted him to ask it was so painfully obvious right but this is this is the thing about it though is like she knows she knows more about him uh than many many of the others she knows that almost everything he does and the, every breath he takes is planned plotted thought out with a purpose like he's gonna sigh here so he could draw someone's attention over there so a fly will do that and like yeah so it's like it's like girl like <sighs> run <laughs> be careful this is not this is not this is not just a a a relationship he's offering here it's strategy there's mm -hmm. there's strings <laughs> Doesn't mean that it can't become something stringless, but right now. <clears throat> I don't want to see her get hurt. You're such an ass. <laughs> Everything's planned. Oh. No. No, he Liar. like no, no. He he not li like that. It, it might not be a a classic anime skides moment type liking, but no, he likes her. He likes what she brings to to the table as far as uh um his his you know goals and stuff like what he's been using her for. She's good at what she does. She's not she's not she's not a um a uh uh god. What what's uh crazy chick's name ah oh, crap shorter blonde hair she like destroyed her classroom oh, yeah. yeah uh went to school with susan a in, in middle school uh she's not like on that level of social interaction but she's in with a lot of people and a lot of people don't suspect her. so he's he he definitely likes that in her he's not lying and i think he does actually like her as a as a person as as well it just might not be romantically right now. <laughs> you guess. <laughs> He is a kid. He is growing. It's adorable. Don't hurt her, bastard. See? <laughs> For the future. Why not?
So it seems like he's even down with. Oh, so he actually wants to feel something. I like that. You want to talk about a, a character moment, like some growth that right there, knowing um, and, and maybe he's always known this and, and it, it, it just wasn't shared uh, clearly through the through the anime, but um, having the desire to be happy, like uh, one of the whether you want to quit smoking or you want to get in shape, uh, no matter what it is that you want to do to to better your life, you actually have to want to do it. And it needs to be more than for someone else. Doing something for someone else is great. You know, like you can want to quit smoking for your for your family. But until you are also wanting to do it for yourself, you're, you're, it's going to be hard to make a, a, a progress. So having him sit there and be like, I want to smile. I want to hold you. And not only do I still want to learn and, and use you, of course, to my own ends, but I hope that at the end of all of this, we can still, you know, be together and that I can. I like that. What'd you think, babe? Surprising because it's kind of like, like I was, uh, you had uh, mentioned Brian strategy. Um, so it's kind of like, what are you, what are you up to? But mm. pleasantly surprised. Yeah. How are you feeling about that, that Brian? Yeah. That, uh, last couple minutes. <coughs> cool really made the episode yeah i'm super excited for for uh season uh four <laughs> season four and getting into year two uh the idea of a of a uh hunt for a for a person um and i don't mean that in like a most dangerous game type way um but you know in in the hunt for this other white white room uh uh kid could be really interesting the co competition with uh susan a and of course now Oh my God, guys! Think about what the implications are for the rest of the harem with him I, picking a I main girl. I was just thinking that. I was like waiting for my my open to say something. Go ahead, Christine. No, no, just I wanted to bring oh, that up because uh, yeah. you had mentioned the um, end of year harem assessment. <laughs> you had a winner. I don't know who won? <laughs> yeah. Uh, do but how do you think that's going to play into uh, his dealings with with characters like Susan A or Ichinose? I don't know. I don't know. You know, Brian, thoughts? Uh, I mean, there'll be more strategy using her against him because I'm assuming it'll be open to every everyone will know they're together. Yes. And um, yeah. yeah, drama. <laughs> tasty, tasty drama. Um, thinking about this season, uh, I thought it was a great season. A lot of fun. Um really really enjoyed everything i don't know if i could grade it yet and especially compared to the other ones i'd need to go back and see what uh what we graded the other ones um but this is good uh good animation uh good good everything is is what you expect from classroom of of the elite music yeah we've talked in the past you know it's nothing to write home about but it fits it works for what it is it's nothing bad um and and uh the the voice acting again all good um thoroughly enjoyed it any anybody have any particular thoughts on season three in in general no all right guys so. well thank you so much for joining us for uh classroom of the elite season three uh check out past reactions if you haven't seen our season two reactions or season one uh review uh please do check those out and uh yeah subscribe here on the genreverse live streams uh uh podcast covering anything and everything in geek pop culture entertainment anime reactions trailer reactions uh lrmonline.com for all uh written entertainment news the podcast celebrity interviews all that goes up on here covering everything comics tabletop gaming freaking uh, uh anime all of it uh link for our merch in the description box below of course all of our logos cute anime girl i am a brian tell them about your channel old mythos on youtube check it out all right, guys. It's been a good, uh, good, good winter season. We will see you next season. Uh, at least Konosuba and Mushoku Tensei. Bye. <laughs>